More than 90% of Android users don't know, like a mic, that there's a secret Wi-Fi menu on their phones. This menu allows you to check whether the Wi-Fi network you're connected to is safe or not. Optimize the Wi-Fi signal, which can make a big difference in speed and stability. Access advanced settings that give you more control over the connection. And if you use them correctly, you'll feel a real improvement in internet speed and stability. But be careful, some settings should not be changed unless you understand them, so you don't mess up the network. Stay with me until the end of the video. This menu is called Connectivity Labs. You can open it through the following steps. Go to Settings. Select Connections. Tap on Wi-Fi. From the three dots at the top, select Intelligent Wi-Fi. Scroll down and tap Intelligent Wi-Fi seven times in a row. A new section will appear at the bottom named Connectivity Labs. Tap it to enter the hidden menu I'm talking about. To do this menu is available on some recent Samsung phones running Android 13 or newer with one UI 5.1 or higher. It may not appear for everyone. It depends on the country or carrier. If you have this menu, you're lucky. What's inside the secret menu? First home Wi-Fi inspection. Tap start and choose your network. You'll see the signal strength in every corner of your home in real time. You can walk around with your phone to find the best spot for Wi-Fi. Two, auto reconnect to carrier Wi-Fi. If your carrier provides public Wi-Fi or hotspots, enabling this option connects you automatically whenever they're available instead of relying on weak signals or delayed connections. 3L4S, low latency, low loss, scalable. Enabling this technology reduces latency on Wi-Fi, which is especially useful for gaming, live streaming, and video calls, making them clearer and with less delay. Four, switching to mobile data faster. Turning this on makes your phone switch quickly from Wi-Fi to mobile data if the Wi-Fi becomes weak or disconnects. Fifth show network quality info. When enabled, it shows network quality, speed, signal strength, stability before you connect. Six, inside customize Wi-Fi list settings. RSI filter lets you display only strong networks and hide weak ones using a slider to adjust the filter. Seven, inside Wi-Fi developer options, change scan interval. If set to but often, your phone scans for networks more frequently, which may improve connections, but uses more battery. It's better to keep it on default unless you have issues with detecting networks quickly. Restart the Wi-Fi subsystem. Fully restarts the Wi-Fi module. Useful if the internet freezes or the signal is unstable. Not something to do too often since it can disconnect the network and you'll need to reconnect. Anya, other sections include connection information, speed and signal strength details, Nearby Wi-Fi information shows the quality of channels used by your router. Wi-Fi and network diagnosis. Diagnoses the network and alerts you if there are problems. <laughs> Enable the settings one by one and test for a day or two to see the results. Avoid changing options you don't understand, like scanning modes or advanced developer commands. If the internet becomes slower after changes, Reset everything back to default using reset all lab settings. The connectivity labs menu Sata, isn't just a fancy feature. It's a powerful tool that can improve your internet and make it more stable. Try the settings above, be cautious with big changes, and you'll notice a real difference in daily use. See you in the next video.